All right, we the Hebrew Israelites coming out here week in, week out to prophesy the downfall of America, which is known in the Bible as Babylon the Great. First and foremost, we want to give all praise and honor and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shah, by Hashem, Rekha Kadash. The one you call God, his name is Yahweh, and the one you call Jesus Christ, his name is Yahweh Shah. Out here, wake, out here another week, weekend, to proclaim the downfall of America. You know what I'm saying? To wake up your so-called Negroes, Latinos, and American Indians to your true biblical nationality, which would be in the Hebrew Israelites. I want to give a double honor to the elders, the apostles, the great meal, so that real well. It's high time to wake up out of sleep, man, for you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and American Indians, man. Starting with the elect, man. That's what we're out here for. Prophesizing the downfall of this place. To wake up one-fourth of our people, man, because two-thirds of our people are going to get put to death. Utterly destroyed, along with America. Babylon the Great, this goddamn dirty whore. But our people don't listen. Our people don't take heed. Y'all despise the word of the Heavenly Father. And when all hell break loose, the time of Jacob's trouble, when they declare martial law, when they have troops on the ground, they're coming to kill you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and American Indians, man. They're trying to exterminate you Israelites from the face of the earth, starting with their, their elite. These banking families, the true mafia. They want a world, they want a one world order, man. So it's high time to wake up out of sleep. So with that, we're gonna get into prophecy, man. Gone. Uh, and, and, they, and they got 11 families running this whole world, know that? It's 11 families running this whole world. That's that's less than 1%, know that? I, that's less running this whole world, man. And like you said, it's just time, high time for our people working out of sleep. Our people to just sleep. Our people think, think they black, they, they, they Hispanic, they think they Native American, man. They sleep. You know, it's a high time to wake up because, like you said earlier, they got to be doing Jacob's Jake trouble coming, but too late then, man. Jake always want to wait till too goddamn late, and then they want to, uh, you know, oh, I get it now. But the most of the level left, just like Noah and the Ark, they the same thing going on now, yeah. it's going on right now, man. It's going on then, it's going on right now. It's like, ain't nothing going on come. You know, we out here warning our people to come back to the law, statute, and commandment, before it gets too late. What they doing? They, 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 uh, like, like, they are like this, uh, goddamn show or something, man. Like, uh, we're going to be out here for, for, for two more hundred years being out here warning them, man. That's a damn lie. Yeah, we about to get up off the streets real soon, man. The family of the words don't come. Uh -huh. They about to they about to hit that internet kill switch any any day now. They said talking about hey, it's about to be July. You know what I'm saying? The fireworks. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. They said in two weeks they can crash the economy. And what you people gonna do in Babylon? You know what I'm saying? You gonna run to the banks? Ain't gonna have no money for you. Uh -huh. You gonna have to get that sea here. You know what I mean? And if you're a so-called black Latino Native American or Israelite foreigner that look like another nation that go back to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, the 12 tribes scattered, and you take that sea hip, which is the Karagma, the, the MOTB, you're going to get put to death, man. Because this devil is going to require, whether you're in prison or whether you're out on, on bond, you know what I'm saying? In order to buy or sell, you're going to have to take the MOTB. And that's the little sea hip, a MOT, a MOTB, which is the Karagma, they're going to literally put that inside you. This is, this is as big as a grain of rice. That's what these elites are going to do when they crash the economy. And you take that, you're going to get put to death, by the, ultimately by the Heavenly Father, man. Because the Heavenly Father is about to send his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai, a so-called black man from the tribe of Judah, to deliver his elect and destroy this wicked and evil empire that's ruled by the Edomites. Starting with their elites, the 1% that the brother just said, man. Uh -huh. These banker families, man, the mafia. You can bring him out here, that wicked. Right there, you know what I'm saying? Started with these people, man, the Amalekites, man, the head tribe of Esau. They're the ones that control the whole earth, man. The Rothschilds, the Gettys, the Bilderbergs, you know what I'm saying? The Illuminati, you people so called, you know what I mean? I got a piece of for you real quick. Real quick real. Romans 13 and 11. In that knowing the time, that now it is high time to wake up out of sleep. For now is our salvation nearer than when we believe. God, now it's the high time to wake up out of sleep. We ain't talking about a physical sleep. You tomorrow, your, it's in your mind. You know, it's a, it's a, it's a spiritual thing. It's hard time to wake up out of sleep. Cause two thirds of our people is, is like, like the Walking Dead. They're the Walking Dead around right here. Yeah. Because our salvation is near, and then we bleed. You know, because salvation is right around the corner now. Because the Most High is on his way back. You know, sending his son. You know, Yahweh Shah sending his beloved son to come back you know, for the nation. Because it's hard time to wake up out of sleep. And like I said earlier, we're not gonna be out here to. 20 or 30 more years. That's why people think, man. Our people think they got 20 or 30 more years in place. No, because in July, like I said, July, everything can hit the fan in July. They're telling everybody right now. They're going to come check cash. 
ain't gonna be no more um, money. They ain't gonna be no more money. They're gonna, they're gonna just give them a dividend. They're gonna put it all on that list. So you got, you got to take the seat here. If you don't, you ain't gonna be able to smoke eat. You ain't gonna be able to buy nothing. And, and, and if you take that, you can put the shelf out of the car. See this beloved son back that, you know, the crash supported. Because these, like you said, it's these goddamn Rothschild and the rest of the, the family, they think they finna keep keep going on and on. They, they think they finna change the, um, the um, you know, call if, 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 if they feel they can get the, the let, you know, the most often when he come back, he don't he don't got nobody to get. You hear me out? 144,000, it's not gonna be here because they're gonna take the C, C here. But but that's the that's the corner from the truth though, man. And, and, and like I said, it's high time for our people working out to sleep because look, these people walking ahead of goddamn they they man, they zombie it off, man, like zombies. They don't know what's going on. Uh, no, yeah, yep. America is straight darkness, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. They got sodomites walking around, you got transformers. They're gonna start they, hey, they're making it illegal in school that transformers oh. to teach your kids, you know what I mean? Oh. They have um, dr um, drag parades at uh, 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 in the libraries at yeah, school and stuff, yeah. man. Hey, this place is wicked, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's why the Lord's gonna destroy this wicked, evil ass place, man. You know what I'm saying? Anybody that likes America is gonna be destroyed with America, man. All the all the nations that got nuclear and firepower are gonna send their missiles over to this place. Why? Because of prophecy. God doesn't like this place. They're talking about a God we trust on a dollar bill. Which God you talking about? Not the God of the Bible, you know what I'm saying? Because hey, this society upholds everything contrary to the Bible, man. That's why the Heavenly Father's about to destroy this place, but I got a picture for you. Wait, 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 wait. It's, it's like Sodom and Gomorrah all over again, 2.0. Mm -hmm. You know, and, and they push that real, real bad on the, on the little one. Because these devils, they think that if they can get the little one, the next side is no, they don't, ain't nobody gonna be, you know, pushing the truth out there. Because they don't, they don't took over and, and push this abomination on, on, on the people. Go ahead, I got a piece that for you. Psalm 49 and 11, their inward thought is that their house should continue forever. In their dwelling places to all generations, they call their lands after their own name. Huh? And who, and who think they gonna rule forever? So-called Edomite, I mean, the Edomite, so-called white people, because they the, they the rule shit right now. They call the Edomite. They, they think they they, they the one change the change the land, the land, you know, the, 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 the what's called that? What the state in the land? They're the ones that make the laws. They want to make the law, change the land inside. You know, like 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 they call the land after their own name. Yeah. Who done that? Called America. One called America. Texas is going to call Texas. And, and you know, and matter of fact, all over the whole world, they change it to their own name. They think they, anywhere important, they think they're going to be ruled forever. That's what they do. They think they're going to rule forever, but they're going to be the deeply goddamn rude awakening in a minute, man. Rude awakening because the, the fire is coming to this place, man. The fire, that's why I'm right here warning the people, trying to tell the people to come back to the law of the commandment before it's too late. Because they don't, you know, and these goddamn. Edomite run this whole goddamn country, man. If you listen to them, you're gonna be bugged off, man. You in the deep sleep. Now we don't want to. You can take a picture of the sign, but we don't want to be recorded here. Uh, you want, thanks, thanks for that. Yeah, like, like you said, you know, if they change the land, they, they change the name to their own. To they, they change the land to their name, to their name. You know, like, 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 like you know, our people say they African American. They're not no damn African American. That's, that's two so-called white man names, man. Two Edomites. Two okay. Edomites. How, how can you come from two, two, two men's anyway, man? Yeah. That's crazy as hell. Because the land of Africa wasn't called the land of Africa. It was really called the land of Ham. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Now, now the, the, the Edomites, they stole that land. They called it Africa after a guy named Leo Scipio Africanus. So America is named after an Italian devil, an Edomite named Amerigo Vespucci. You know what I'm saying? So in their inward thought is that they're going to rule forever. They really think they're going to rule forever because Job 9 to 24, it tells you that the earth was given to the hands of the wicked. He covered the face of the judges thereof, if not, and who is it? So who has covered the faces of the true judges? No. Here it is. You got these people in the land of Israel, the 1948ers, you know what I'm saying? They stole that land and they occupied the land as we know today. You know, they have the biggest rainbow parade in that land. You know what I'm saying? When the Heavenly Father's against sodomites, you know what I'm saying? No. And then you got sodomites, you got these popes molesting little children, you know what I'm saying? You know, and they don't even get arrested, you know what I'm saying? They just run to the, they just run to that land, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. And get off, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. This place is sick, man, you know what I'm saying? That's why it's going to be destroyed. One of the many reasons why it's going to be destroyed. Ultimately, you got the Heavenly Father's people in captivity, man. The so-called blacks, Latinos, and American Indians, man. Because we ain't black. We're not African. We're not um, Hispanic. We're not Mexican. We're not none of these bywords and proverbs that the so-called white man has labeled us, man. Because when you look up the word black, means death, man. Uh -huh. we look up, that's the play on words, man. Everybody has a biblical nationality, man. 
You got 18 nations, and everybody has a biblical nation that you go to. And it so happens that the so-called blacks, Latinos, and Americans, and we go back to the 12 lost tribes of Israel, man. That's our true nationality, man, our heritage. Uh, <clears throat> just like you said, uh, uh, if so-called uh, black, Hispanic, Native American, we are the real Israelites. We, we, we the children of the sea with Moses, when Moses crossed the sea, but, you know, we, we know the Israelite come in different colors. You know, it's like a speck of bird, you know. And, it's, and like, 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 like I said, two-thirds, man, two-thirds, hey, if they don't get this, they're they, they, they going to miss the boat, man. They're going to miss the boat. And this time they're going to miss the ship. I mean, the, the chariot. They're not the chariot. They're going to miss the chariot this time. Yeah, that is the ship. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, come on. Here it is, we came on slave ships, but we're going to leave in spaceships. You know what I'm saying? Oh. And the Heavenly Father's going to come back in the biggest ship, the Father's ship. That's why in slavery we used to sing that song, Swing Low, Sweet Chariot. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Does somebody bring me home? You know what I mean? That's right. Why do you think the slaves didn't say that? Because we're the Israelites, man. That wasn't a song that the so-called white man taught us in slavery. We were singing that song by the river Jordan because we are the two biblical Israelites. The real Jews, which is one tribe, the head tribe, are you so-called Negroes, man. We're the real Jews that the Bible speaks of, man. The real Jews that weren't so-called white people, man. That's us, man. We're the real Jews. And that's one tribe from 11, man. Hey, we were lost, but now we're found, man. Hey, he said, do y'all hate me because I tell you the truth? You know what I mean? Cheering right here. Cheering. And, and, and see, in the, in the uh, so-called white people, they tell them that they you they, 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 they you're old, but they really know who the chair before though. They know who the chair. That's why they they is come out, you know, they big green peoples and with big eyes and stuff. No, that's that's the that's the most high angels in those chariots. Yep. Just like when, when people see shooting star, that's a chariot. That's not a shooting star. It's a chariot. And people, and people don't see they they get our people by words like you know how how how, how they tell you a lie and they, they ain't gonna tell you the truth they'll they'll put you so much proof a little proof in about to be the biggest lie though how they cherry and what they what the cherry come back for they say one hundred forty four thousand Galatians four and sixteen am I therefore become your enemy because I tell you the truth and that's what's happening man we're out here telling the truth and you got brothers out here around the whole world man speaking this gospel the good news. Only for the elect, because the Heavenly Father ain't coming back to save all so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Americans. So he's, de he's only dealing with a small remnant, 144,000 that he's going to deliver, man. And you got Israelites that look like other nations. You got Israelites that appear to look like so-called white people. Uh, uh, but you try the spirit by the spirit. And you can tell by the spirit because, you know what I'm saying, their forefathers go back. These, uh, somebody on this tribe, their forefathers, you know what I'm saying, somebody on this tribe. Whether it be a so-called black man, whether it be a so-called Puerto Rican, whether it be a so-called Mexican, you know what I'm saying. Bruce Lee wasn't a so-called Japanese or Chinese man. He was an Israelite, you know what I mean? But he looks like, he appears to look like a so-called Chinese person, you know what I mean? That's why I said earlier, you know, the Israelites like a speck of a bird, you know? They come in different, different shades of color. Uh -huh. They can have blonde, have blue eyes, and they still can be an Israelite. And uh -huh. you could be a stone, jet black, like Wesley Snipes or Edomite. Yep, come, come, you know what I'm saying? It's all about your father, you know what I'm saying? Come. And your pedigree goes back to um, the, the, the man, you know what I'm saying? Not the woman, you know what I'm saying? And we, and we, and that's just the truth according to the scriptures, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. This whole this whole world teaches you, it goes back to the mother. They do everything contrary to the Most High, man. That's why the Holy Father's not destroy this goddamn place, man, because it's wicked as hell, man. Uh -huh. So, just like you said, if I'm your enemy, I'm telling you the truth. Yeah, so the, we are the common state enemy because we're out here telling the truth. The government enemy, that's why they're trying to label us like, like you're a hate group. Terrorists. You know, terrorists, hate group, all of that, man. They, put, they put us at the top of Come. the list. Come. When have, you, have, when have you ever seen some Negroes, Latinos, and Americans come like the KKK and hang people on trees or, you know what I'm saying, dragging them, behind, uh, uh, killing them, you know what I'm saying, shooting them down and doing all that, you know what I'm saying? Come. You still today, you have this goddamn devil, you know what I'm saying? By the way, the police, they get away with it. They kill a so-called Negro, you know what I'm saying, Latino, and American, and plant drugs, you know what I'm saying, do all types of things. And they get off, man. They get a paid vacation, you know what I mean? Get to retire with yep. the benefit. Get to retire with that. And they teach, their, they teach these goddamn devils, you know what I'm saying? Um, uh, uh, um, the whole, the whole police force, uh, they teach them to uh, uh, kill so-called Negroes, Latinos, and make things hunt, hunt our chest, man. Because that ultimately goes back to the, the curses, man. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? They wait in late. You know what I'm saying? They uh, set up traps. 
Then they got these cool ass Negroes, Latinos, and Americans that the so called white man sets up. By the way, of celebrities, by the way, of false pastors to keep our people asleep, man. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, and, and, uh, and a police officer back back in the day used to be the slave catcher. Yep. They were, they were slave catcher first. It's on the patty rollers. It's on yeah. the patty rollers. Nothing, no, hey, ain't nothing new under the sun. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. If you had a nigga get away, you know what I'm saying? They just call the patty rollers over. You know what I mean? Because uh -huh. you got regular, um, like regular Edomites. They said that. That wasn't me. That was, a, that was a, you know what I'm saying? Like, I had them hey, if you go back in slavery, you, it was you regular Edomites too, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You regular Edomites had a pick. I mean, that's where you get the word a barbecue, you know what I'm saying? Pick a nigga, you know what I'm saying? Pick. Picnic, you know what I'm saying? Wow. You should just pick a random nigga, you know what I'm saying? Wow. And have a picnic and had a bunch of crackers, you know what I'm saying? Come, come around and, and put them on fire and hang them on a tree, you know what I mean? Come. Take and take, take pictures, you know what I'm saying? Take, and a post, post take postcards, picture, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And send it to people, one another, you know what I mean? Wow. This is the true history that this devil don't want to be um, 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 told about, man. But you're being exposed, man, right before your face, man. You know what I'm saying? Kind of, they, they go back and from your enemy trying to tell you the truth. Yep. Hell yeah. You know who your enemy is. They are enemies. Yep, you know what I'm saying? And the reason why all these things happen to our people, like the whippings, the lynching, and all the abominable acts that happen to our people because we broke the law, said the commandments of the Heavenly Father, man. The Heavenly Father gave you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Americans. But the law, said the commandments to obey by. And if you didn't obey, he was gonna put your, these heathens over you, man. And this is our last captivity. And this is the last we off for the so-called white man starting with their elite to get over on our people. That's why they're hiding in their underground bunkers, their satellite stations, you know what I mean? Their things that they got, their things that they got in the sea, you know what I'm saying? Right now they got this big thing in the news, some things looking for, searching for the Titanic, you know what I mean? And I don't even know why they didn't put I guess the people died, you know what I'm saying? They did, got blew up. They got blew up, I guess, you know what I'm saying? Because they can't find the people, you know what I mean? You can't find the little uh, submarine, submarine that they put them in, you know what I mean? They said the submarine blew up. But they locked uh -huh. it to where they can't even get out, you know what I'm saying? They could, you know what I'm saying? Why would you do that? It was a failed mission to begin with, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's like, that's like getting in the past and get buried. Yep. You couldn't get a bunch of them there, you could stuck, man. They couldn't pay for the $30 to get in that goddamn submarine. You know, they said the submarine blew up. So now, now, now they did. Or so they're going to make it alive like, like, like they get down there to the Titanic, you know? Yep. So they've been lying the whole time. They can't get down there too far. That's all he's going to do is lie, man. Yeah, tell a lie. When he's speaking, he's speaking of his own, you know what I'm saying? The truth don't benefit these souls. So far, yep. white people, it don't benefit them, man. Yep, it don't. Yeah, it, it don't benefit two thirds. You know what I'm saying? This truth don't benefit two thirds of our own people. We we don't give a damn about two thirds of our people. Like like the prophet Jeremiah said, pray not for these people. You know what I'm saying? Our people don't want to listen to the truth. They despise correction. They they despise um, rebuke. Yeah, I see you got so much. I had a couple on my legs too. Oh, what? Like the medallion. Oh, my medallion. Oh, oh. Yeah, see, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yep, yep. Jeremiah 7 and 16. Therefore, pray not down for these people. Neither lift, lift up cries nor prayer for them. Neither make intercession for me, for I will not hear me. So, like what he said, he said, pray not for these people, man. We ain't praying for two thirds of our own people because they're wicked as all hell, man. They don't want to get right. They despise the word of the Heavenly Father, man. They want to be niggas. They want to go rob their own people. They want to um, sell drugs. They want to go commit adultery. They want to cross dress. They want to love America. They getting ready to celebrate the 4th of July. You know what I'm saying? Nothing but lies. You know what I'm saying? You so-called Negroes was in captivity. You still in captivity. You was a goddamn slave in the 4th of July. You know what I'm saying? So what, what, so what were you free? You weren't independent. You know what I'm saying? Our people were still in slavery. We're still in slavery to this day. You know what I'm saying? We ain't never been free, man. I'm talking about Abraham Lincoln freed the slaves, you know what I mean? No, he didn't. He, emancipation means a transfer. All they did was transfer you to the government, you know what I'm saying? First, you know what I'm saying? That's all they did. A transfer of power. They took y'all off the goddamn slave farm and then sent you over to the government. Now they rule over you, you know what I'm saying? Jake is simple as hell, man. Our people are simple. They're homeborn slaves. But that's why he said pray not for these people. Uh, they they took them out of one captivity, put them in another captivity. Yep. That's yep. all that was. What they got to celebrate? Nothing. They gonna they don't get fireworks. Hey, the real fireworks is when, 
um, going to be the missiles and the power from the chariots when America, Babylon the Great, the spiritual Egypt, which is our captivity, gets destroyed. That's the true uh, fireworks. You know what I'm saying? Yahweh Hashem El Shai that means Lord willing. This be the last year, man, that we got to um, be in this goddamn captivity, man. We get the hell up out of here, man. We're looking for salvation. We're looking for a new heaven, a new earth, where righteousness dwells. Hey, hey, this place is wicked as hell. You got women over a man. You got transformers. You got mofos. You got people that want to uh, marry themselves. You got people marrying a laptop. You got Beyond Meat. Uh, lab, lab grown meat, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That they're about to start selling their store. You don't know what you're eating because the food is all polluted. This man done destroyed all the animals. Uh -huh. You got the animals dying. The earth is dying itself, man. We got to get the hell up out of here, man. You like this place, well, you like hell, man. Because America and the whole earth is hell, man. This is hell on earth. This is, people act as if this is the kingdom of heaven. This this place ain't built on family morals, family structures. You know what I mean? Oh. How, how, how? When, when the, uh, the deception of the world is Christopher Columbus discovered the new world. When he how you discover a place that when you have people already here, right. the so-called Native American Indians were already here already. And then when you came, they helped you uh, uh, survive. survive in the winter. They taught you how to bathe and do all that. What you do? Backstab. Them. I was curious, what nationality are you? Like, what's your forefather go back to? Are you like Irish, Italian? Irish, but I'm a rainbow warrior. You're Irish? Your dad's Irish? Yeah, my grandmother came to Germany, but I'm also a rainbow warrior. Because your grandmother got that too, it's your father. Your father, but she said Italian. Yeah, uh, German, Irish. Oh, well, you could be an Israelite. You could be an yeah. Israelite, see? Because we don't, this thing, this thing of the heavenly father, is ain't about Israel. It's about Jewish people. Yeah, it's about Jewish people. 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 It's about Jewish in, in your um, forefathers, where your forefathers, the seed line. My grandmother had to take me from the little girl. She was telling died and not in the Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because, um, they, 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 that, I mean, I don't know if you know, but. Because, yeah. I don't know if you know, but Hitler, he, Hitler knew who the real Jews were, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Hitler knew the real Jews were so called Negroes. You know what I'm saying? Because the real Jew, which is short for Judah, Yahweh, you know what I'm saying, in Hebrew. Really? You know what I'm saying? They're ish. Those are ish people to be like or pertain to. When you look up the word, anything that it, like if I told you you were a child ish, are you a child? You're not. You're a grown woman. You know what I'm saying? But you're acting like a child. You know what I mean? The people, the people in that land that occupy Israel today, they're not the real people. They stole our identity. Yeah. The, the real Jews, our so-called Negroes, you know what I'm saying? And I'm a, I can show you that in Jeremiah 14 and 2. Because it says, Judah mourneth the gates thereof are language. They are black to the ground. Like, look. Jeremiah 14 and 2. Judah mourneth in the gates thereof language. They are black unto the ground. So that word black, when you look it up, in the, in the Hebrew it means kadar. It means dark skin. So the, it's telling you the real Jews are dark skin. You know what I'm saying? And the cry of Jerusalem has gone up, yeah. Because the cry of Jerusalem has gone up because they're in captivity. You know what I'm saying? The real Jews are in captivity until the Heavenly Father delivers them. So where do these people that occupy the land today call themselves ish people, the J-ish? I got to speak like that because they'll take the video down on, when I put it up on YouTube. They'll censor it and, and, and give me a strike. So you got to talk, I got to talk in code. If, if, if that is... If, if they're the true people, why well, I gotta speak in code? They wanna worry about it. Huh? They wanna worry about it, you know what I'm saying? Because they're not the people, you know what I'm saying? They don't, they don't want you to wake the real people up. Yep. When you wake the real people up, they're gonna be in trouble. Yep. And we're the real we're the real Israelites. And we're one tribe. From um, the Negroes being the real Jews for the tribe of Judah is one tribe. You got eleven other tribes. These are Jacob's twelve sons. You know what I mean? But yeah, it said, Judah morning to gauge their own language. We language, our leaders, you know what I'm saying? Our failed us, you know what I'm saying? Our families are failed us, you know what I mean? This whole society has failed us. Why? Yeah, why? Because we trust in oppression. Our people have been trusting in oppression for far too long. 
instead of trusting in the one true power, the Heavenly Father, which his name is Yahweh, Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai. What did he call God? His name is Yahweh, and his son, his name is Yahweh Shai. And he's a so-called black man for the tribe of Judah. But see, Hitler said, this is what Hitler said. Oh, look at what Hitler said before he died. He said, oh, what do you mean, his precious jewels and sons and ass? Hitler said, a man passed stolen the Jews. The Jews have died. His Jews, the Negroes, they are the true Hebrews. See? So Hitler knew that the true Hebrews were the so-called Negroes, man. And the word Negro is just a byword. In a proverb, man, that our people go by today. That the so-called white man has labeled us today. And that word nigger. That's the attitude I learned. That word, see people, you know what's crazy? That was the N-I-D-G-E-R. That word is in the Bible. Did you know that? That's in the Bible. Uh, that's in the Bible. But it always has the negative co co condensation that it has now. You know what I'm saying? Because uh, you know, whenever Esau takes something, you know, he flips it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That word doesn't always have the negative condensation. Like and, 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 and that means they, they, they was the, the, the first Christian, the Christian. Yeah, yep, yep, and Antioch, that's what I'm about to bring up, yep. Because yeah. a lot of people don't even know that, the word N-I-G-G-E-R, that's in, that's in the Bible. It's an act. Every public so-called white man, he, he owned all the, 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 the TV, you know, he owned Hollywood. He owned the earth. He owned the whole, the whole earth. So he can put what he want to put out there. He ain't gonna put the truth. He gonna put what he want to put out there. So, so, so that's why, um, like you said earlier, well, we your enemy because you because we tell you the truth. So since we out here tell the truth, he label us as enemies. He label us like um, we out here just just telling one big lie. You know, and all the time, the lie, the lie been told since day one. Yep. Since we got the Gulf of Slave Ship. Yep. They, 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 they didn't tell us who we really was. Yep. So they, they took our identity and ran with it. They didn't figure our identity back. Because they called themselves the Ish people. The Ish people. But the Ish people, like like the I said earlier, if you call you childish, that means you're not a child, you just acting like a child. You know, but you really grown because that's, that's what uh, the oxygen is talking about. You know, the real, uh, we like the word nigga in the Bible, those, those, those were the real um, um, Christians. It was the Israelites. It was the Israelites. It was the so-called black folks, you know what I'm saying? Southern kingdom, you know what I'm saying? Called that in the Bible. Yep. They, they don't never call it so-called white people a nigga. It does been called that. And I got it right here. Acts 13 and 1. Now, they were in the church that was at Antioch, certain prophets and teachers, see? Prophets a prophet and teacher. Yeah. In order to be a prophet or a teacher, you got to be an Israelite, you know what I'm saying? In order to be a saint, you got to be an Israelite. A so-called black, Latino, and American Indian are an Israelite corner that look like the 12 tribes scattered. Certain prophets and teachers, as Barnabas and Simeon, that was called nigger. That word, when you look it up, you know what I'm saying, means black. And Lucius of Cyrene and Manan, which have been brought up with Herod the Tech Patriarch and Saul. Apocrypha? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Apocrypha. Yeah. Like, yeah. But see, oh, that's uh, Apocrypha, that means the hit, hidden, the book that was hidden. But if you get yeah. this, see this book, they go together. Because yeah. if you get a 1611 King James Bible, yeah. it's, in, it's, in, it's in it. And King James, by the way, they lied on him too, claim that he was a sodomite and all that, you know what I'm saying? King James was a so-called black man, you know what I'm saying, from the southern yeah. kingdom, man, you know what I'm saying? And King James didn't write the Bible, he just got teachers and uh, prophets, you know what I'm saying? To translate it, you know what I'm saying, into English. You know what I'm saying? But Herod and Tetrarch and Saul, those were Edomites, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, you know what I'm saying, they were called nigger. Why were they called nigger? Because they were black. So-called dark-skinned people, man, you know what I'm saying? But this is the truth that they don't want to get out, man. But it's too goddamn late. You can cut off the internet. You, you, um, you can get us off the street. You can put us to death. You know what I'm saying? You still ain't going to stop this truth. The Heavenly Father is still going to destroy America. He's going to deliver his people. And we're going to rule over all the nations, man. Thus say the Lord, man. And that's the time that we're living in. The fall of our enemies. The fall of this wicked and evil-ass society, man. That has taught nothing but lies. And now that we're standing up, you know what I'm saying? They mad. You know what I mean? Like that's the they can't do nothing against the truth, only for the truth. See, see the East are thinking um, doing something against the truth, or yep. he's helping the truth, like yep. the internet. Yep. The internet was really created for the truth to get out. Yep. Like you said earlier, they finna shut down the internet in a minute. They finna shut this whole society down. Yep. Why? Because the truth is, 
killing the airwaves. You know what I'm saying? Everybody knows about this truth. This gospel has been preached around the whole world. Everybody's waking up, and they know this. Thing, and they know this thing of um, of Yahweh Bashim Rashi ain't about black people. It ain't about none of that. You know what I'm saying? It's about the nation of Israel. And you got Israelites that look like so-called white people. Like for example, Cameron Diaz. She's an actor. She looks like a so-called white woman, but she actually goes back to the tribe of Issachar. Why? Because her fa her father is a so-called Mexican. You know what I'm saying? But her mother was a so-called white woman. You know what I'm saying? An Edomite. You know what I'm saying? But we have to say terms like this: so-called white, so-called black. So you understand who we're talking about, you know what I mean? But yeah, uh, uh, who else? Justin Timberlake. Justin Timberlake, he's a singer. He looks like a so-called white person. He's not a so-called white person, he's an Israelite. Uh, uh, from the tribe of Gad, I believe, you know what I'm saying? From the so-called Native American Indians. So that's their true, that's the true um, heritage, the true nationality. The Gadites. Yeah, just like John, John uh, Travolta, Italian. Yep, yep, mm -hmm. yep, yep. Israelite, He's an Israelite. Robert De Niro, Al Pacino, those are Israelites, you know what I mean? You know who that is, right? Robert yeah, De Niro, Al Pacino, those are Israelites. And see, now, that's why a lot of people bring up the Irish. The Irish went to slavery too, you know why? Because those are Israelites, you know what I'm saying? Those are Israelites that look, could have looked like so-called black people or could have looked like so-called white people, but they knew their forefathers went back to the Israelites that ruled Europe, you know what I'm saying? Because um, whether you believe it or not, the so-called black man um, um, which are the tribe of, uh, of Judah and the so-called West Indians, which are the tribe of Benjamin and the Levites, which are the uh, so-called tribe of um, um, ha uh, Haiti. They ruled Europe for a thousand years, you know what I mean? And then, the, uh, then, then we had to take a fall and all, and then the so-called white man came in power in the 14, 1492. Then, then he put up his images, you know what I mean? The so-called white man called the Dark Ages. Yep, then, like, the, the Dark Ages. Like when nothing's going on there. Yep. That man of sin is being revealed, you know what I'm saying? That's why he's angry. Yeah. Like you said earlier, that's why he comes against us. He's making us everything except the truth. And he got the power to do this. Like I said, the earth is given to the end of the wicked. So he, he comes to face and judge all that. That's why this this picture, man, it's like this picture right here. Man. This picture right here all over the whole world. Like he put this picture up. He, he put this picture up like, you know, he covered the face of the judges, but he put this face up. The greatest man ever walked, 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 walked the earth. whole earth. And that's a goddamn lie. That's why we have horns on them and a, a surface tongue. I feel safe. I can't because, tell hey, according, according to the Bible, the Lord didn't look like... He looked like this. Look, look like that. According to the Bible, the Lord, the Lord didn't look like this according to the Bible. Yeah. He didn't look like this at all. But the whole world believes that this, this is what the Lord looks like according to the Bible. He had blonde hair, blue eyes. This man actually lived, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. This, this devil actually lived. His name was Cesare Borges. And his pops, his name Pope Alexander VI, what he did when they came to power around the 1400s, they commissioned Leonardo da Vinci and his gay lover, I forgot his name, to paint his son's image in the likeness of the Heavenly Father, the Messiah. And now, you, what you fast forward today, you got everybody believing this goddamn lie. You know what I'm saying? And that's the biggest lie on the goddamn planet Earth that the Lord was a so-called white man. You know what I'm saying? That's not according to the Bible. The Lord looked like a so-called black man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Skin color as bronze, hair like wool, white in, in color. You know what I'm saying? And a voice of many waters. You know what I'm saying? He had a very white voice. You know what I'm saying? A Morgan Freeman voice, a deep voice. The so-called white man don't talk with a deep voice. He talks like, like he's real whispering. Soul. You know what I'm saying? Real soft. You know what I mean? He talks like a sodomite. You know what I'm saying? Like a, mm -hmm. a cross-dresser that he is. Huh? A cross-dresser that he is. You know what I yeah, mean? He sounds like hey! Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. A commander hey. voice. An austere man. You know what I'm saying? Oh. You know what I'm saying? But they got this lie that everybody holds on to the You know what I'm saying? Because the earth is given to the hands of the wicked. You know what I mean? Oh, and he put this face up all over the whole earth like the most high Look like this, but that's a lie, though. That's a devil. Like you said, before, that's why we got the devil horns. Like it's a lie. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus is a Negro, not a white man. That's the truth. Yeah. Yep. He was an austere man. Yeah. That's why he said, "Gird up thy loins like a man." You know what I'm saying? Oh. That's what we do. We're gird up our loins like a man. We come out here on the highways and byways, and we preach this. Time in, in season, out of season. Whether people here or from there, you know what I'm saying? We don't give a damn. You know what I mean? Because when all hell breaks loose, they're going to be looking for us, and it's going to be too goddamn late. You know what I'm saying? 
They're gonna wish they listened. They're gonna wish they listened. Because you're looking at your future slave masters up here. You know what I mean? All you nations are going to slavery, thus say the Lord. Hey, um, slavery has a part two, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, manifest destiny has a part two. Goddamn, he's in my city. All these nations are going to slavery. Because look at, as for the other people that come from Adam, they are nothing. All the nations are going to eternal slavery under the Israelite man. All these nations. The Hamites, which are so called Egyptians, Ethiopians, Libyans, South Africans, the Athletic people, Shem, Chinese, they're all going to slavery, thus say the Lord. You know what I mean? But see, that man of sin is being revealed, so that's why he's hot. I got a piece of it. Right. First Thessalonians 1 and 7. Lock it. First Thessalonians 2 and 3. Let no man deceive you by any means, for that day shall not come, except there come a falling away first. And yet, let, uh, let no man deceive you by any means, for that day shall not come, except there come a falling away first. And yeah, that's what happened. We had to fall away, because we broke the law, statutes, commandments. But now we're back, baby. You know what I'm saying? Our mother, man, that that man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition, the son of destruction. So that man of sin is being revealed. The man of sin is a so-called white man. He's Edomite, the son of destruction. How did they went around the whole earth, rape, robbery, and murder? How they get everything? How did? Has the so-called white man? Did he come here and got everything by righteous, righteously, or did he steal this land? Here it is. They'll tell a Mexican to go back to Mexico. The whole Western, this this country belongs to the so-called Mexicans. You know what I'm saying? What the hell are you talking about? You know what I'm saying? They'll tell the so-called black man go back to Africa. You know what I'm saying? But who the hell are you to tell anybody to go back any goddamn way? Well, you don't belong no goddamn where. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Everywhere you occupy, you stole it. You know what I'm saying? You stole yeah. you stole Europe. You stole the America. You stole everything you got. All Africa, the riches that you got. Yes, Africa. You know what I'm saying? Whole world. Oh, the, the whole world. world. You got the whole world in your hands, you know what I'm saying? And you got to pay for it, you know what I mean? Now she's being called out, so you're the man of sin. Now you got a problem with it, you know what I'm saying? No, 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 he's trying to, he's trying to lie like it's the people, you know. It's human race. World. It's the human race, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Nah, it's your red ass, you know what I'm saying? Oh. And you got everybody following the leader, which is your ass, you know what I mean? Yeah, our people are wicked as hell. Who they learning from? They learning from the so-called white man. The biggest drug dealer and the biggest gangster on the planet Earth, you know what I mean? Right. You know what I'm saying? Here it is, he opens up all these pharmacies to keep, to keep people on drugs, you know what I'm saying? To keep you people hooked, you know what I'm saying? So he, so, so he can make money, so he can make money. Exactly. He keeps people hooked on these drugs so he can make profit, so he can make profit off you. That's all he gives a damn about, money, 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 you know what I'm saying? Right, Where you got 1% making all, billionaires, trillionaires, you know what I'm saying? You got all these people homeless, I'm sleeping on the streets. This goddamn devil don't give a damn about his own goddamn people. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, How much more you so called Negroes, black like people, than American Indians? See? Hard times, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. See, Jake is going through hard times. We want to get the hell up out of here, man. That's why we need the Lord to come back like yesterday, man. Oh. This how far. Second Thessalonians 2 and 4. Who opposed and exalt himself above all that is called God. And he had a so called white man oppose himself. Uh, he does everything contrary to the Heavenly Father, man. And he says, I am God. You know what I'm saying? Right. You, you better worship me, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Oh. I'm your God. You know what I'm saying? If you don't worship me, I'll kiss my ass. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to have to exterminate your red. I'm going to have to exterminate your black ass. You know what I'm saying? That's how the so-called white man thinks. You know what I mean? Yeah. Look, 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 you put up all these goddamn laws up. Uh, a smell for the get out of here. Yep. You, know, you don't go by what he said. He'll put you in jail. He'll put you in jail. Yep, yep. You got to bow, bow down to this devil. That's why he yep. got. That's why he got his money and faith is all the money. Yeah. So he ruled. He ruled the goddamn world. He rules the whole world. And his god is Satan. You know what I'm saying? His god is Satan. He worships Satan. This, and that's that's what they're talking about. The USA and God we trust. Uh -huh. The god of the, the god they trust is Satan. You know what I'm saying? That's the, and money's they um God too. That's right. right. Uh -huh. the back of the dollar bill on all that. Yeah. yeah the pyramid. The pyramid. You got the pyramid. You got the all C and I. You yeah. know what I'm uh -huh. saying? So that's spirit, they worship spiritual Egypt. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. America's spiritual Egypt. Hey, what was going on in the past is going on now. Ain't nothing new under the sun. Uh -huh. Let me finish this off. First, Second Thessalonians, two and four. So that he as God sitting in the temple of God, showing himself that he is God. And that's what the so-called white men, these Edomites, have done. They they, they oppose they they oppose the heavenly Father. They sit up they sit up as if they're the heavenly Father. Like everybody gotta listen to me. He's all around me. The whole world and everybody else's backyard telling them what to do. You know what I'm saying? 
Because if you don't get down with his philosophy, you know, he, he's going to put your ass down, you know what I'm saying? He's going to kill you and put a pu puppet in there, you know what I'm saying? That's right, that's right. A lot of these people that you think, uh, uh, are, like, uh, they work for the CIA. Like, Osama bin Laden, he worked for the CIA. He was a CIA agent. Basically, he was a crash dummy, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? They set him up. And they put him where he was. They put him there to say he was a fall guy. He's a fall guy. Some of the Lana was set up and worked for the CIA, for the American United Snakes of America. You know what I mean? He was a fall guy. And that's what he does. He uses fall guys. He sets your ass up to, to do do his dirty work. And then when, he, when, he, when you're done doing all the work for him, he, he sends to his squad to exterminate your ass. You know what I mean? So what's the sense of um, selling out to this goddamn so-called white man? When all he's when he's done using your ass, he's gonna put your ass to death. You know what I mean? Right. And that's what you got on this side. A lot of these so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Americans, they love to kiss ass. You know what I mean? They love to uh, uh, follow the ways of the so-called white man, their daddy, the master. You know what I mean? Uh, and that's why they be in the condition that they're in. You know what I'm saying? Uh, they wonder why um, uh, they get played. You know what I'm saying? Like a right. pimp playing his hoe. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Uh, slap around. Yep. Get up, get out of line. Yeah. Hey, cause our people love this condition that they're in, which is captivity. They love to be oppressed, you know what I mean? Like, they don't ask questions why they're in this state that they're in. Nothing. They don't ask questions why they're in. They don't know what's going on. Why is this happening? Exactly. Yeah. Well, I know why. <laughs> you got yeah, you, yeah. You get, This whole system is set up and designed to keep these so called Negroes, Latinos, and Americans at the goddamn bottom, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. It's functioning exactly like it's supposed to. You know what I'm saying? Look, look out to like it. If it was slavery, then Jim Crow, yep. then red tag, and yep. the keep going on and on. Yep. The laws they set up and yeah. everything. Kind of, after the cotton field, they put they built prisons. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Right after uh -huh. slavery, they built prisons. Sure you know what I'm saying? Sure and then did. they put Jim Crow laws all over the place. You know what I'm saying? Where you niggas, where you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Americans gonna get ahead. You know what I mean? And you're never gonna get ahead. Uh, uh, 500 plus years of the hardcore slavery, it's still going, you know what I'm saying? How the hell you, how you, how you, you going to catch up? How, you, how can you bounce back? You can never bounce back, you know what I'm saying? Because now it's a mental slavery. Uh -huh. There's no sense to keep your ass off with Same. shackles. Right. I have your mind, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. I already have you, your mind, body, and soul. And ultimately, that's what he wants to do now with the New World Order. When he comes with the sea hip. He wants to implement, he wants to implement everybody to have that in their body. The, uh, the sea hip, which is the MOTB. The mark of you know what? That's the revelation. You know what I mean? You want to put it inside your body, where you can control your thoughts and all that. You don't think they got it already with the COVID shot? Oh yeah, she yeah. knows the juice. The juice. I didn't take nothing. See? <laughs> hey, you take the. You, hey, they're coming out now. Yeah. Hey, they're coming out. They're coming out now and saying they apologize Woo. for everybody uh -huh. that took the. Um, um, the Canadian president said they apologize for everybody that took the. This um the the juice the juice the jump we talking in codes what yep yep a lot of people got bad people yep oh yeah now they selling it yep hey so this is hey think think about it here it is they done made weed legal right so all these people that are locked up for weed charges they should get out of jail that's right why are they still locked up and get paid yeah and get paid yeah because you got you know what I'm saying and get paid see this see this man's the goddamn devil. Hey, this man, that's, hey, that's the devil for you, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Here it is, you lock people up for drugs, and then he makes drugs legal. Hey, he done made it where people can get crack pipes. Yeah, yeah. 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 What, what's the, hey, you know how you got machines where you got a snack machine where you can get like yeah. a recess, you put change in there, you get recess. They got machines now in New York where you got you, uh, a, a person that's a drug user can um, um get crack pipes out of it. What about Narcan, uh, put people back to the flatline on this one? See? Yeah. Hey, this place is wicked, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But people love you here. God bless America. You're right. God is going to bless America with nuclear fire. You know what I mean? Oh, it's a, it's a like, uh, it's, I love my like God more than you as well. Look, look it's a like, and, and just like uh, when, um, you know, they, the reason he, he, he was putting Jake in jail for selling these stuff, he could get his cut. You know, like you <laughs> say, he all about money. Yeah. He could yeah. get his cut. So Jake was making all that money once getting. He saw his cut. Yeah, so yeah. So he's done. I'm going to make we illegal. That's really what it is. He's always wants his cut. He has to, he yeah. has to get his cut off top. You know what I mean? Because right, he's the biggest 
drug, drug dealer. Drug, a drug dealer. You know what I'm saying? Gangster. Yep. I got a precept for you. Job 13 and 4. But you are forgers of lies. You are all physicians of no value. You know what I'm saying? They're all forgers of lies. This is no bother. Esau, the so-called white man, he forged a lie. He, he went around everywhere lying. That's all he do. That's like, it's like when he first born, that's all he do, speak a lie. And that's what Esau has done. He, he, he forged a lie. After you tell a lie, lie for so long, and you continue to lie, 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 lie. it sticks. You know what I'm saying? It comes true to him. Yeah, it comes it, it come true. That's what he did to the people. He, been, he bewitched the people. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But see, the Lord has splinter cells. You know what I'm saying? Started with the elect, 144,000. We're going to repent and come back to him. So that's what Esau's mad about. Because you know, the 144,000 ain't going to bow down to the red ass. You know what I mean? You can't put them out of his hand. Yep. Uh, He's going to try everything in his power to get the 144,000, yep. but he ain't going to be able to do it. Yep. The Lord's about to give his man spiritual power. You know what I'm saying? Whether you believe it or not, you think it's a, it's, a, it's funny, it's a joke. Man going to be flying. The Lord going to give his man spiritual power to fly, to um, uh, zap his motherfucker out uh, with, um, uh, with lasers out of his eyes, all, all type of things. Yeah. You know what I mean? He's going to be a weapon himself. You know what I mean? Right. That's the power that the man of the Lord is going to have in these last days, if they be able to elect. You know what I'm saying? Because we can't beat this devil by ourselves. This devil got uh, army, uh, he has weapons, he got lasers, he got drones, all type of things. He got tanks, like yeah. army tanks and all type of things. He got, he got bullets in top corner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We can't, we're going to have to have spiritual power to take this man down. I can't, you know what I'm saying? That's why we're patiently waiting, man. You know what I'm saying? The Lord's going to have to give us spiritual power. We're not going to do nothing on our own. We're going to wait patiently for the Lord to give us the power we need to to subdue our enemies, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. See, see, we, see, we, we're not carnivore up here, we're spiritual. We're going to wait for uh, the brother to come back. The one that's called Jesus, the Howard Shaw going to come back. That's what we, we, we wait for. We ain't doing nothing carnivore. It's just the spiritual. It's just like somebody on the highway, the highway. We need our people back to the truth, like the spiritual. like half our brain, a little bit of our brain. So once the Lord opens it up, I don't know if you ever seen that movie called Lucy. You ever seen that movie called Lucy? Once well, this girl where she can think with 100% of her brain and she has spiritual power. You seen The Matrix, right? Yeah. You seen the movie The Matrix? Yeah. Hey, basically like The Matrix, power like that. We're gonna have power like that. Yep. We're gonna have power like that, I got a precept. Isaiah 40 and 31. But they that wait upon the Lord should renew their strength, see? They that wait upon the Lord should renew their strength. And this is, hey, this is a form of power, us standing right here before our enemy, before the world, you know what I'm saying? We look, we look, to the world we look like a spectacle. We look, we look like we don't know what we're talking about, we're bugged out, you know what I'm saying? It says, they shall mount up with wings as eagles, they shall run and not be wary, and they shall walk and not faint. See? That's power, that's spiritual power, to run and not faint like the flag. Eagles, you know, like the Flash, fly. you know, the comic book, the Flash, yeah. where he can run and don't get tired? Yeah. Flash hell, yep. Go around the world, shh, yep. just like that. And you're better to fly like eagles. Yep. You know, fly, have wings, fly. Yep. If it's eagle bird, eagle yep. can fly high and yep. bird the world. That's spiritual. Yep, yep, yep. 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 That's right. Hey, and it's not big, not tired. That's right. Straight, not not be tired. Now if you try to run, after a while, after a while, you're like, yeah. <laughs> I need some water, you know what I'm saying? About to die, I'm about to die, you know what I'm saying? You're like, yeah, I need to start running more every day, you know what I'm saying? But nah, in that day, we ain't even, we're going to let the Lord renew our strength, you know what I'm saying? We ain't going to be worried, we ain't have no worries, you know what I'm saying? Right. He said, you, you, you should not faint. I'm going to renew your strength. You should not faint or not be tired, you know what I mean? That's that spiritual power that the Lord, the man of the Lord is going to have in that day, starting with the elect. Lord willing, will be a part of that number. Because right. the Lord's going to give his man spiritual power, real talk, um. whether people believe it or not. You're an Israelite, brother. You're an Israelite. Hey, You're... I'm from Baltimore. I'm from the East Coast. How the hell y'all get out here? Hey, we everywhere, brother. We How everywhere. You know what We everywhere, brother. Why? Hey. You said hey. Hey. Yeah. 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 hey, that's the power of the Lord. Power of the Lord, man. Yeah. Hey, he said, yeah. hey, you see him you see out there everywhere, huh? Yeah. But they got everywhere. But when I just woke up, they got Israelites Yeah, Hey, it's a. Hey, I, hey, the water, shallow off. That's the power of the Lord, brother. The power of the Lord. 
Hey, see this gospel? This gospel is being preached around the whole earth, man. That's right. He's waking up in his black. <laughs> Hey, that was his testimony. Huh? That was his testimony. He said, Baltimore is all the way on the East Coast. Yeah. A, major, a major city, you know what I'm saying? Oh he said, I see the brothers out here. And they got Israelites out here. That's the power of the most high. Yep, that's the power of God, man. All praise be Yahweh Shem El Shah. Water, water. Man, because we, because we, we, we are ready, ready to get off. You know, I'm not supposed to carry you on the milk. I have broth in my back in the place. So I can do dishes. I can carry, uh, dishes. Yeah, hey, have you working the stiff way? Yep. Have no worries. You know what I'm saying? Like you said, you've been homeless for a month now. You said, like a month. But you, but you still, but you still believe in the heavenly father. You don't give up, huh? I'm not here like three thousand children because they're the ones that have to learn to love the man. Yep, yep. You got a good spirit, yep. Yeah. Saint Matthew's twenty four and fourteen. And this gospel of the kingdom should be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations. And then shall the end come. See? Right, that's right. And and, and now you you are you're telling war, you see Russia and Ukraine warring and, and the other country finna get the war. See, like I said, this word should go all the way around the whole world and then the end should come. The end is on its way. See? That's why we are here warning our people to wake up and come back to the law such commandment before it's too late. Because the end is coming. See, most of these people walking in, walk, walking around here, they don't got a, a slightest idea what's going on. And they don't kill. Yeah. But 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 they don't know they're gonna be made for the destruction of that day. Oh, the light work? Your light? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is in the Bible about the light. See, that's, yeah, what, that's yeah. what we out here doing. We're we, we letting our light shine. Light shine right now. Yeah. Like that song, this little light of mine. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. let it shine. <laughs> <laughs> so I think karaoke without wearing Mr. Hensel off and stuff like that. I think dance is royal. Okay. Yeah, but, 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 but the end is coming. The end is near. Yeah. The end is here. A lot, a lot of people don't get it though. A lot of people don't look, look at it like that. They think this place is going another 20 or 30 more years. We don't got 20 or 30 more years. We barely got 20 or 30 more months. Yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't even give it that long. You know, I don't know, but you know, yeah. I'm hoping it'll come way faster than that. Really? Know, we, we tired of being in this wicked place. You know, we go on with this place. This, this is, we're not of this world. We don't give a damn. Oh, Lord, I'm going to go home, but my job's not done yet. I have a yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. I have a wicked. I know who I am. I know where I've been. I know where I'm going. Huh? Like, that's that's the spirit. She said that. Yeah, it is. It is. Make that stuff. Yep. I just want to go home. Yeah, we were. Our work is not done yet. Yep. We want to go to the upper room. Our work is not done. Yep. Yep. I got a piece of art. Saint John, eight and twelve. Then spake Yahweh Shah again unto him, saying, I am the light of the world. He that follow me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like she just brought out about the light. You know, the light. See, the man of Ox up here and the rest of the brother push page 144 truth out the light. You know, and we, if we walk through the most high, we're not going to be walking in darkness. Because we don't do nothing wicked no more. That's the best our ability. You know, we don't, we don't try to do nothing. We, we're not, we not going to do nothing wrong by our, like, like some people do willingly. We're not going to do it willing. We do something wrong that means we made a mistake. We're going to repent, ask forgiveness, not to do it again. Yep, yep. We, we're not going to go walking door. Come. I got a precept for y'all right now. St. Matthews 5 and 14. You are all the light of the world. A city that is set on a hill that cannot be hid. See, That's we ain't right. hid here no more. Yeah, we ain't hid no more. See, we out here like the brothers just walked past that stuff in Baltimore we out here the light you know the light is not here no more you know we like sitting on top of a mountain you know we telling the people it. that's right telling the people be warning the people what's coming but, but it's, it's up to the people to take it a lot though our blood gonna be up our hands because we're required to do that and, and, and a, lot of, a lot of people got and, and death is coming ain't nothing coming to this place but them nothing coming to this place but them they they been coming they don't see a lot of people dead already they don't even know it they walk they walking in the 
The living dead. That living dead walking around. I ain't even know it. You know, you know like that was, uh, you know that song I saw you by Nas? We just walking, talking, uh, yeah, we yeah, 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 black, yeah. Uh, black zombies. You know what I'm saying? That's uh, our people. Zombies. Yeah, that's uh, our people too. Hey, because, hey, real talk, these people are black zombies. You know what I'm saying? Because black means death, basically. Right, you know what I'm uh, saying? A dead dead man walking. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and that's what these that's what these people of this world are, Babylonians. You know what I mean? Uh, dead man walking. They're dead men walking. You know what I mean? Because they don't got no truth in them. You know what I'm saying? Yep, yep. And that's the best that's the truth though. They are dead men walking. Yup. Cause that hey, hey, death, you know what I'm saying? Uh, they have to know death by pain, you know what I'm saying? Uh, two a lot of people that sometimes they and for people to figure out they gotta die. <laughs> <laughs> they gotta die. Yeah. King James. King James. Yeah. They, 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 they know a lot because they go to this church. 16, 16, 16, 11. 16, 11, 16, 11. That's right, huh? Since the sports young go to church now. Yeah. Hey. I would tell him that. Yeah. Because he's not in, in, in no place that he built with, you know, like the, like the yeah. church when he ain't. I got it. I got it. Yeah. And, and, and she just didn't go to church enough. That's, that's loves, spirit, huh? You know, and the It's spirit. Yeah, he ain't dealing with these church hardly houses. Come, come that's what they is. That's, it's a lot, and that's all they doing. Be beating our people to, to the slaughter hole. That's all they doing. And you said you had to give your tidings to the church. I helped my fellow man out. Right? This is the church. We calling out. That's right. That's right. Church means to call out. I got the precept out for you. Okay. Acts 17 and 24. The Most High that made the world and all things therein, seeing that He is Lord of heaven and earth, dwell not in temples made with hands. See, He's not in temples built with hands. And look at all these. Before the whole city got around these churches and these malls and kingdom halls. He's he not in no places. That's Satan in there. That's demon. That's why the people be having demonic possessions. <laughs> oh, I'm catching the Holy Ghost. No, you catching the demonic ghost. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you catching the demonic ghost. You know what I'm saying? It's like my back in the day, we went to a sacred sanctified church and people fall on jumping. Man, my brother was scared. We were young. We were scared, man. Like these people catching like they. Yeah, they catching demon. They get a demonic. They catching a demonic possession. You know what I'm saying? Let me finish this off for you. Acts 17 and 25. Neither does he worship with man's hands as though he needed anything, seeing he gives to all life and breathe in all things. I'm going to read it again. Acts 17 and 25. Neither does he worship with man's hands as though he needed anything, seeing he gives to all life and breathe in all things. God, see, most high don't need nothing. He, he didn't want that life to all, all the creatures on the earth. He done that. He, he put air on all creatures on the earth. He don't need man's hand to work with him because he's the most high. Yep. Come on, come on. I got you hear something about God having a loud voice. I put a gun in my temple and I heard his voice. What are you doing? Back up the head. It awoke me up when I thought it was more. That was God. Oh. He had a loud thought like, what are you doing? Back. Okay. You know what he say? He was like, uh, uh, oh, okay, okay. Yeah. So, if you know that soft little boy, you know, like, that's what you watch, like, tell everything. Uh -huh. You know? Yeah, so, like, like, most I don't need nobody. Yeah. Nobody with him. Hey, it starts within us. You know what I'm saying? The kingdom's within us. Right. Well, I got a precept real quick, Doc. Okay. 1 Corinthians 3 and 9. For we are laborers together with the Most High. You are God's hus husbandry. Hus husbandry. You are God's building. So, you know what I'm saying? It's it's within you. Yeah. So, we, we consider him husband. I mean, his, um, where's like, building? His building. His building, yeah, it's not so like that. That's what you're doing to be building. So you can build a, 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 a building, brick, build at a time, one brick at a time. That's what we are here, building a brick. One brick at a time. And that's the elect, starting with the elect, the tabernacle of Malak Dabba Da. That's King David uh, in the Hebrew. 144,000, each brick, each, each brick. And we are here in front of 144,000. Out of 144,000, I hear this group. And when they hear this group, they go run, run, run to it. I got yeah, I'm waiting for that. It says, Luke 17 and 20. And when he was demanded of the Pharisees when the kingdom of the Most High should come, he answered them and said, Luke 17 and 21, the kingdom of God 
come not with observation, neither shall they say, Lo, here, or lo, there, for behold, the kingdom of God is within you. Gather together. That's, that's the, you know, like, like the man of Oxnard here, you know? We, we, we started in us, you know? 